guys, what should we do with these? Like, these guys are unconscious. These guys are in a really bad way. I've brewed up some yeah, health you, potions. Does anyone have instant health? I do. I actually have three on me right now. It might take three goes to get these guys right. These guys are really bad. Do we want to revive these guys, though? Like, these guys are aliens. These guys are essentially from another planet. Well, this one looks human. He looks yeah. human. And that one looks like a puffer fish. <laughs> I don't know what he looks like. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I mean, Is I he going to poison us? I definitely think, think we should revive him. Suit, though. He's I fine think, to yeah. yeah. Well, I'm going to give the first dose. It's going to take three to three goes. Everyone stand back. Yep. All right. One, two, three. All right. That's one go. No, they haven't all right. Yeah. All right. Um, oh, we try the second go. All right. Three, two, one. Oh, these guys are so far gone. We might be able to get him with this last one. Let's see. All right. This one's, this one's twitching a bit. He might be, he might be waking twitching. up. twitching. Yeah, all right. All right. One more. Five, Three, five, two, one. Come on, guys. Come on. They look like they're waking up. Oh, hey. oh, yes. oh, 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 hey. Yeah. Hey. oh. Uh, do guys. Do you know who you are? Yeah. Uh, hello? No. Who am I? <laughs> you, where are, you are where are we? You are in a space center Ewok on Scoutcraft. You look familiar. Did we make it? Make it. Uh, Did we make it. You um, guys crash landed. Well, we technically shot you down because you were heading into our atmosphere. Uh, you shot us down. Uh, we were <clears throat> we, we were flying. Yeah. From, uh, from let's let's just let's just talk about that later. We is didn't. This, we we shot you down. <laughs> this looks, it, it looks like another ship here. Are we on another ship or did we land? No, you, this is not a ship. Uh, this is a facility. But we can't yeah. let you leave unless we know who you are. Facility? Uh oh. Are we uh, prisoners, Puffster? You, you want to introduce yourselves so we know who you are. Ah, okay. All right. Well, I'm full bump, and um, um, I guess I've been shot down, and I'm your prisoner. <laughs> we'll see I'm about that. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'm Puffster, and uh, I've been shot down with this guy here, and uh, we're, we're prisoners. Do you, uh -huh. do you remember anything? Do you know why you were in a spaceship traveling? Uh, I, we were uh, we were traveling from planet Bedrock, right? Yeah, our planet ran out of resources. So um, yeah, that's oh, really? we had no right, choice right. but to, to find a way to leave there. And, um, you know, we got up in the space and we got lost. And, and next thing I know, wow. I'm waking up here. Well, so if you come up... to steal our resources... Yeah. <laughs> no, not necessarily. We, we had not we steal. Did, we, we have we have money. We have money, right? I don't have anything. I, 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 if you guys resources. come up here, if you guys follow me, you will find that resources are plenty on the Scout Craft server. You'll poke your heads out one of these windows right now. Not that one. That's the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to head the other way. <laughs> that way is the ocean. All right. Oh, wow. All right, we're going to head. You know that, now that you know that we've shot you down, do you come in peace? Yeah. Well, oh, yeah. I mean, honestly, honestly, oh, I don't yeah. think we would have known yeah. how to land to begin with. So I'm glad glad we, you shot us down and we're all right. Yeah, this yeah, there's well. no way for you guys to leave your ships kind of in pieces. Oh, no. So, I mean, who yeah. wants to leave this place? This place is like jam packed with stuff. Wow. Exactly. Oh, look at this. Great. Yeah. What's all this? So, you guys are I'm free to it. make your home here. This can be your I new guess. home. We're going to have to monitor you. I guess uh, we're going to have to monitor you. To yeah. I'm kind of shy. Though, welcome so to Scarecraft. Well, oh, thank you. Yeah. Welcome to Scarecraft. We're going to have to monitor you over the next couple of weeks to try and make sure that you guys aren't carrying anything with you that can harm us. Um, but I think you guys yeah, seem gonna, like pretty. Well, uh, we're gonna need you guys to quarantine for an episode and build a starter base. Well, I oh. do feel a little <laughs> okay. Um, I yeah. Do have a rash. <laughs> you build a house to stay in quarantine. You gotta be don't, build don't a house. Close, so don't get close to me. Don't get, I don't wash my hands. <laughs> <laughs> I never wash my hands, odd. That's all I ever do is wash my hands. Oh, oh sorry.
Hello there, Minecrafters. I hope you enjoyed that little story to kick off this video. And if you haven't quite figured out what's going on yet, I have some great news. I was invited to join the Scoutcraft server, and this is my first official episode from there. And I want to thank all of the members of Scoutcraft for the opportunity, and I've just been so looking forward to it. So if you don't know what Scoutcraft is, it's a group of Minecraft YouTubers and streamers who, um, well, we all play on the same survival server. And we've got a lot planned for the server. Um, some really big builds, mini games, pranks. And so if you like that kind of let's play stuff, hit the subscribe button and, uh, you know, tune into future episodes. But uh, I'll also put links to all of the other scouts channels below and you'll definitely want to check them out. Um, just kind of off top of my head. Uh, and I hope I'm not forgetting anybody because I'm new, but Madsify and um, Leaguer and Oddman and Newmark and Jumble Wolf. Who else? Lan Lanaret. And I can't think of all of them off the top of my head, but I will definitely put links down below so that you can go and uh, check out their channels. And I highly recommend that. Now, to get on with this episode, we need to find a place to build our starter house. I had a pretty good look at the world map, and I know I want to be in this area near the Badlands and the jungle biome, which is somewhere over this hill. And um, you can have a look at the map as well. If you check out the Scoutcraft Discord server, um, which I'll link to below, you'll see a topic for uh, Scoutcraft map. And uh, that way you can kind of get a sense of where everybody's built their bases and what biomes they're in and stuff like that. Plans for this series. So this is season one of Scoutcraft and we'll be moving on to season two when Minecraft 1.17 comes out. So I've got a limited amount of time in this world and um, a lot I want to do actually. So first thing is to get a starter base you know, get geared up, get Elytra, get, you know, enchanted gear and get some farms up and running, you know, like a villager breeder and an iron farm and a creeper farm. And it's just to get the basics out of the way. So we've got a good amount of supplies to, you know, actually be able to run in this world. So um, then I want to tackle a, a big build and I'm thinking of a jungle temple, not a mega build. Because I think 1.17 is uh, coming out too soon for me to finish a mega build, but a big build. And at least big build, I mean at least biggest I've ever attempted. Just show you what we've got done so far. As you can see, we've got ourselves some nice shiny iron armor. And uh, off in the background here, you can see I've got some crops planted. And I spent a lot of time feeding livestock and, you know, breeding up some cows to get the XP and over here we dug ourselves a diamond mine and uh so down there we did pretty well we've got some diamonds actually we've got enough to make a full set of gear i'm just holding off on doing that until i've got uh enchanting table and we can try and get uh some good enchants on that might head over to the shopping district and see if maybe I can afford to buy some books of mending as well, because it might be a little while before we have our own villager to do that. But anyways, I just didn't want to bore you guys with the stuff about kind of getting set up. And given that uh, Scout Craft Season 2 is going to start as soon as 1.17 comes out. So I'm that's supposed to be sometime this summer. So I figure I've got just a little bit of time left here in Season 1, um, and I didn't want to or you guys with just the routine of, you know, feeding the animals and feeding the livestock and growing the crops. But we are ready now to build our first starter house. So I've got it all laid out here is we'll just get the starter house done and uh, at least have a decent place to live because uh, sleeping out here and there's a creeper over there, but sleeping out here under the stars is uh, not my favorite thing to do. So I'm going to hop into just a quick time lapse and we'll, we'll get that built.
All right, so just uh, taking a quick break from that time lapse, and I thought I'd show you some things that we've also done as far as texturing and how we've made the place look. And so you can see over here, I've kind of finished off the foundation and added some more blocks under there, as well as started to add some texture to this, as well as the roof line. Like you can see right here, I've got some stone and we put in some more mossy um, brick and stone there as well as done some texturing on the roof so instead of just the acacia logs the stripped ones we've got a little bit of terracotta and some acacia planks that give it some some pretty nice texture I think and I'm going to go ahead and work on that aspect of things adding texture and some details on the outside and then on the inside they left this open because we're going to put in a nice fireplace and I'm thinking we'll probably use um granite and probably some red bricks that uh, I think that color will kind of tie in with the acacia but not be exactly the same and then over here we're going to put in our um, enchanting setup so this is going to look kind of like a library with a nice view out that window probably right in here we'll put our bedroom set right here um, over here is going to be storage so we'll have lots of chests and then we'll have uh, barrels lining all of these pockets in the walls up here so there'll be plenty of storage and then of course we could add some lighting and some more details and finish off the ceiling and really make this look pop make this pop so i'm going to get started on that and i'll be right back to show you what we've got done well i think we've pretty much got our starter house in order here and I think you're really gonna like it. It's definitely, uh, definitely something I've never built before. So here we go, here it is. See, we've added the detail. I kind of finished off the roof and we've got the, the fireplace and the chimney in there and it's go. I added some of these bushes out front and I did this, I kind of got a mix of oak leaves and spruce leaves and then I put oak I put vines over the top of them to kind of give them some thickness, but we added some buttons, stone buttons here, and we've got the oak trap doors across the front, and we've got some fence gates down there, and then we've got some more bushes, a little bit growing off of the roof there. Um, so that's kind of what we've done on the outside. I'll take you around. You can see this side here, we've got the chests inside, but you can see how the oak fence, uh, fence gates there. And then we did the chimney kind of out of granite and some red brick and we left some little holes in there and then I got the spruce trap doors at the top. So this is the back of the house. I think we need to add some lighting, but other than that, let's show you the inside. All right, so if you come in here, I've got storage over here and we'll probably put some, um, item frames on those and then we've got some additional storage up here but you can see i've kind of started to get things organized a little bit we've got our crafting table we've got some furnaces we've got a table saw and i'll probably put some more tools over here but we've got plenty of storage then we've got the fireplace and we've got armor stands so as soon as we make diamond armor we will uh We'll retire this iron armor as an heirloom and we'll put it on the armor stands. And then that's our first uh, sword that we made out of iron there. Then over here, we've got the bedroom and I've just decorated a little bit, you know, added the potted plant and some carpet and sort of a tree in a pot over here, um, you know, and a light, but I might, I might work on this some more, but for now it's good enough and then we've got our library with our enchanting table set up and so we've got a grindstone here in case we need it we'll have some storage up here for you know lapis and books and things and i threw a couple of potted plants in the corners but it's got kind of a nice view from here out at the mountain out the window when you're enchanting and um you know other than that i'm real happy with it i think it's come out pretty nice i've never worked with acacia before so this is really my first attempt and uh, I might replace this carpet with a different color as soon as I get access to some more dyes. Um, just, just to see if we can break it up a little bit. We might add some more in here, but other than that, I think it's off to a great start. We got some terraforming done outside here. Um, I was experimenting with this lamp post. Not sure if I'm gonna keep it that way. I think it's a little bit too big at, to at the top, um, but we'll see. So that's how it came out. So anyways, that's our starter base, guys. We're all set to go for the next episode. We're going to get ourselves the diamond armor made up and get some enchantments. 
And uh, we got to visit the shopping district because I think I want to get some some books and some other things that we're going to need. But thanks for joining me and I will see you in the next episode.